This is All India Radio. In the program Samvad, now we bring you a virtual celebration of World Environment Day by the Ministry of Environment, Forest and Climate Change with focus on the theme Nagar Van, that is urban forests. World Environment Day, led by UNEP, is United Nations' most important day for encouraging worldwide awareness and action for the protection of our environment. Since it began in 1974, World Environment Day has grown to become a global platform for public outreach that is widely celebrated across the world. On this occasion, I would now request the Honorable Minister of Environment, Forest and Climate Change, Shri Prakash Javrekar, to please address the gathering. मेरे सहयोगी राज्य मंत्री बाबुल सुप्रियो, महाराष्ट्र के वन मंत्री संजय राठौड़, यूएनसीसीडी के एग्जीक्यूटिव सेक्रेटरी इब्राहिम थाउ यूनाइटेड नेशंस एनवायरमेंट प्रोग्राम की एग्जीक्यूटिव सेक्रेटरी एंडरसन माय सेक्रेटरी डीजी फॉरेस्ट एंड अदर कलीग्स टुडे इज वर्ल्ड एनवायरमेंट डे एंड द थीम इज बायोडाइवर्सिटी एज यू नो इंडिया हैज 16 परसेंट पॉपुलेशन ह्यूमन पॉपुलेशन ऑफ द वर्ल्ड वी आल्सो हैव 16 परसेंट पॉपुलेशन ऑफ कैटल्स इन द वर्ल्ड बोथ रिक्वायर लैंड वॉटर एंड फॉर्डर और फूड बट we have only 2.5% of the world's land mass and we have only 4% of natural water resources therefore we are in constraints but still india is able to preserve 8% world's biodiversity this is no small feat because india has been able to prove this that here is the country which preserves biodiversity despite constraints इंडियन कल्चर इज लाइक दिस क्या आपको पता है कि पेड़ न काटे न कटे इसके लिए राजस्थान में 300 लोगों ने बलिदान दिया था 300 हंड्रेड पीपल डाइड टू प्रोटेक्ट फॉरेस्ट इन एवरी विलेज वी हैव फॉरेस्ट इन द नेम ऑफ गॉड ईश्वर के नाम से एक वन होता है जिसमें न कटाई होती है न चराई होती है प्रकृति के साथ हमारी जीवन है our lifestyle is with nature and trees prani jalachar vanachar pakshi pashu all species of the world are part of our life aaj jaise aapne dekha waha varje mein vat purnima hai to mahilaye pooja kar rahi hai ped ki i think this is unique in the world that people are worshiping tree they worship animals also they worship the reptiles also and they worship all kinds of life one sanskrit famous saying is prithvi rakshiti rakshita nature protects those who protect nature what we find today is we have forest in rural areas but not much forest in urban areas while i was traveling throughout the world in new york in rio de janeiro nairobi and even in mumbai we have national parks in many cities there are forest patches in my pune city also forest has developed two three good forest but we need more and therefore we have introduced the scheme of urban forest shehron mein udyan hai gardens hai but we don't have forest so we have to create forest and we have decided today to launch our nagarwan program urban forest program in 200 corporation cities of india we started in pune in 2015 and with the help of forest department people's representative the guardian minister the member of parliament member of legislative assemblies corporation and as was shown by tata motors persistent foundation and ter policy center this was the best example of ppp and that is the model for improving the forest urban forest in 200 cities city forest will fund we will fund it to an extent to compound it and to carry out minimum services there from the campa fund as india has decided to create 2.5 billion or 3 billion tons of carbon sequestration new forest creating new carbon sinks and that will work as urban lungs also therefore i appeal to city corporations because many commissioners have also joined forest officials have joined let us map forest land in cities and degraded land in city and if that is reserved for creating these urban forest it becomes a people movement ye jan andolan hoga aur isliye 
सबको साथ आकर काम करने का मैं अपील करता हूं आगे चल के जैसी योजना आगे बढ़ेगी अच्छा वन जहां बनेगा उसको पुरस्कार देने की भी हम योजना करेंगे वी आर थिंकिंग इवन टू इंट्रोड्यूस अ गुड प्राइज फॉर गुड फॉरेस्ट क्रिएटेड बाय पीपुल्स पार्टिसिपेशन एंड इन पीपीपी मोड इन वेरियस अर्बन सिटीज आई थैंक ऑल दो हेल्प बिल्ड पुणे फॉरेस्ट एंड विल बिल्ड मोर फॉरेस्ट इन वेरियस अर्बन कॉन्ग्रमेट प्राइम मिनिस्टर हैज ऑलवेज एम्फोसाइजेस ऑन एनवायरमेंट ही सेज इंडियन लाइफ स्टाइल इज नेचर फ्रेंडली वी हैव अ लाइफ स्टाइल ऑफ सस्टेनेबल लाइफ स्टाइल मन की बात में इस बार 31 तारीख को उन्होंने कहा था पेड़ लगाओ और पेड़ लगाओ का मतलब पेड़ बढ़ाओ भी केवल लगाने की बात नहीं है तो पेड़ लगाना भी चाहिए पेड़ बढ़ाना भी चाहिए यही हमारे लिए ऑक्सीजन बैंक है आज के इस कार्यक्रम में नगर वन योजना के लॉन्च में मुझे लगता है यही संदेश है सबको बहुत बहुत नमस्कार जय हिंद मे आई नाउ रिक्वेस्ट ऑनरेबल मिनिस्टर ऑफ स्टेट श्री बाबुल सुप्रियो टू शेयर हिस्स थॉट्स विद अस ऑनरेबल मिनिस्टर श्री प्रकाश जावेकर जी ऑनरेबल मिनिस्टर फॉर फॉरेस्ट गवर्नमेंट ऑफ महाराष्ट्र सेक्रेटरी श्री आर पी गुप्ता जी कोलीग्स इन द मिनिस्ट्री ऑफ एनवायरमेंट फॉरेस्ट एंड क्लाइमेट चेंज टूवर्ड्स दी टूवर्ड्स अंडरस्टैंडिंग द इम्पोर्टेंस ऑफ नेचर टूवर्ड्स अंडरस्टैंडिंग द इम्पोर्टेंस ऑफ बायोडाइवर्सिटी एंड वाई एनवायरमेंट इज वन थिंग दैट वी ऑल नीड टू यू नो वी ऑल नीड टू कॉन्सेंट्रेट अपॉन इट इज द साइंस दैट नेचर इज गिविंग इज वेरी मच लाइक टूडे स्टे इज वर्ल्ड एनवायरमेंट डे and it's it's like an extension of mothers day like we all grew up in our childhood getting warnings from our mothers when we did something wrong i think the nature today under the pandemic and what whatever we are going through in the world what we are fighting together is is a nature's call is is a planet mother planet letting us know that we all need to be more careful and the efforts need to be more concerted to ensure that you know we take care of our of of this planet in the manner that it should be i feel honored to address this august virtual congregation on the occasion of world environment day the world environment day reminds us to continue our commitment for environment protection and biodiversity conservation you know these are very trying times while we are talking about coming together and making conscious efforts towards biodiversity towards everything that we could do for the environment the trying times requires us to be uh, you know uh, to follow the social norms of 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 distancing and staying away from each other so there are new ways of connecting and i think once we have our hearts connected to this to this very noble cause and something which is a not only a noble today has become a necessary a uh, 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 you know a cause for the planet i think uh, we will be able to conquer the challenges that we face uh, now and Uh, the impending challenges in the future as well protection of environment and living in harmony with nature are integral parts of indian culture it's very interesting that wild animals association with people's religious beliefs like snake with lord shiva with lion with goddess durga peacock uh, with lord kartikeya these things are not just coincidental they seem to be a conscious effort by our wise men uh, and women and saints to preserve this kind of life forms and uh, the you know the wild the huge horizon of plethora of different kinds of friendly animals and different kind species that that uh, reside with us around us today climate change poses a fundamental threat to the places species and people's livelihoods it will be the greatest cause of species extinctions in the country and therefore to address this crisis there is an urgent need to reduce carbon pollution uh, tree plantation in that direction is going to be very helpful and we sh- it should be it has it is should be and it has been transformed into a multi sectoral activity taken up by various central and state governments schemes by civil societies uh, and because of such concerted efforts every year tree plantation right now has taken up an, on average over 1.6 million hectares This year the target for tree plantation as planned by the ministry in coordination with the state governments has been enhanced to 145 crores which we will which we would definitely feel we are going to achieve by people's participation. Uh, this year government of India has decided to make tree plantation a people's movement and about 34% of the population in the country 
which resides in urban areas. And if all of us, you know, for all of us, if we decide uh, to, to plant one, a minimum one tree around us where we stay or in a vacant land, I think it is going to help the cause of, of you know, uh, uh, of the climate and also control the carbon emissions and the carbon dioxide that is released in the air because of a lot of activities, be it pollution, be it cars, uh, whatever, mobility, etc. On this occasion, we should make a pledge. We should make a serious pledge uh, that forest areas in the cities will be protected and preserved through our collective efforts. And uh, that is why, with a view to enhance biodiversity in our urban landscape, Ministry has chosen uh, the Nagarvan as Nagarvan rather as theme of World Environment Day. I mean, urban forest as World Environment Day. To end it, uh, I must one, once again reiterate that we should make a conscious and concerted effort to minimize the use of natural resources and treat all living creatures on the earth, including wild animals, with compassion. Our government has also decided to take up rejuvenation of major river basins in the country through forestry interventions. Tree plantation and soil moisture conservation works with the, with, will be the core strategy to address the problems of soil degradation, situation, siltation, and reduce water flow in the river basins and the catchment area. All countrymen, including farmers, are guided by our government under the, under the leadership of our, and direction given by our Honorable Prime Minister in unison to rejuvenate the rivers in partnership with the government programs. On this day, I would also like to recognize the immense contribution of the fellow countrymen, civil societies, and most importantly, forest officials in protection of the forest, wildlife, and the entire ecosystem. Sir, with your able leadership and inspiring words, I am sure that with the same zeal, enthusiasm, and efforts, we will be able to protect the environment and <coughs> conserve biodiversity in and around all our cities as well. Jai Hind. Thank you. The current health crisis has made us realize how important it is to be with nature which is on the verge of a breakdown. For too long we have exploited nature and it's time we realize that we need nature more than it needs us. May I now request Secretary MOFCC to share with us the Ministry's vision regarding conserving and protecting the environment. Friends, we are meeting in a very difficult times and a very unusual time to celebrate this World Environment Day. Our use of resources that should be minimized, that should be efficient and that should be recycled. We don't need to say anymore that how we depend on forest and why we require forest. The cities which are dense agglomeration of population, those are the places where the nature has lost its quality. The air and the water both are going to be degraded to, to such an extent that our they are putting enormous strain on our health systems our vitality, our strength to withstand different diseases, that is going a major change. So we must go back to the nature. And it is in this context that today's launch of the scheme of Nagarvan that is most important and relevant. The cities, they require large area of forest. And on this occasion, when we are launching this scheme, I would request the municipal bodies to take the lead and decide that a certain percentage of their area must be reserved for the lungs of the cities. They must be protected, they must be preserved, they must be developed and everyone should be taken in this endeavor. The municipal bodies, they must take the lead, the civil society organizations, the industrial units in the city and the citizens. They all need to come together and develop these forests for their own survival. The ministry will be providing every possible help in this endeavor and I again congratulate everyone on this occasion of the World Environment Day and hope for the success of this scheme and for the future of our citizens. Thank you. I hope all of us and all the people across the country will help implement the Nagarvan Yojana and transform this vision into reality. You were listening to virtual celebration of World Environment Day by the Ministry of Environment, Forest and Climate Change with focus on the theme Nagarvan, that is urban forests. You can listen to it on our mobile app News on AIR. This program is also available on our website newsonair.com. You may email your opinion about this program at airnsdtalks at gmail.com.